Hey, what's up guys? We're back with some more raids today and we're starting today's video off with just an absolutely perfect cliffside bunker style base. I'll show you guys what I'm talking about here. The dude has built it perfectly into the rock. Check this out. Almost completely hidden except for down here at the bottom of the cliff. Let's ladder up this thing and I'll show you guys the view from the top. Still need to figure out where we want to go in on it. Maybe eventually end up wiping it. It's just perfectly flush with the rock. Okay, yeah, so above here it just looks like a few foundations placed. Oh my gosh, if the loot's all the way back in a square here. I actually don't think that we're going to have enough stuff to do it. Broad enough to do like three armored walls. We can rocket out a few armored walls with the 17, 18 rockets, and then we can drill through two. But I didn't realize this thing is coming all the way back here. Okay, so we need to guess if the loot's going to be like top floor, first floor, or somewhere in the center. Honestly, just the perfect base build. If you put the stuff in the back center part, it's probably going to make us have to come back here with more stuff. Let's give it a shot here, just drilling straight up through it. I'm gonna send rockets. We'll go for first floor and hopefully my turret can cover us. Let's try this. Okay, we opened up two of the top floors. We can send one rocket there. I'm gonna go second to half floor here. Maybe we'll run into the top of the TC if it's placed down here. If not, we'll have to come back here and then drill up. Okay, are we getting any progress here? Down to two rockets, 8C4. Yeah? What? Is that, a, is that a foundation all the way back there, dude? Bruh, are these like connecting foundations? That is so OP, however you made this. Uh, I think we're going to have to come back to hit that foundation. I think we're going to need to bring back some more rockets. If we send rockets like directly in that corner, that should expose a lot of this thing. You know what? I'm going to come back here with rockets. Let's hope that nobody comes here and is camping my raid base. We'll be right back. Okay, well, I decided to kind of go overkill on this thing. It'll bring 33 rockets. I'm guessing we're going to have to rocket out two armored walls here. But yeah, just did not expect there to be another foundation placed all the way back. Almost like this guy's abusing something, but we'll give him the benefit of the doubt and just say he places it good. Nobody came by, which is nice. So we're going to send some rockets all the way into the top corner there. Hopefully reveal something. Let's not clip onto that boulder. Are we even hitting the foundation? I don't think we can hit the foundation with that. Let's actually try to hit the foundation instead. Okay, I need to check the health on that thing. I'm pretty sure that's 16 rockets. What? Foundation is not even getting hit. Are you kidding me? All right, well, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm going to send, I'm, I'm going to see if we can sneak C4 straight onto that. Please tell me this hits. Yeah, let's go. It barely hit. Legit the perfect bunkers. It's still all stable. How is, there's another foundation back there. What is this, dude? How? How is that even possible? Can we sneak rockets into there? They don't even hit, man. The rockets just don't work. So, now we need to see four. I guess we just pray there's something up in this triangle area. We'll take this wall down too. Hopefully, something will fall from the sky. Was that something? I don't think so. You know, I feel like we're not even going to be able to loot this thing once loot does fall. Okay, we got the foundation down to 1300. We should try to kill that.
Do we kill it? Yeah, that looks like a box. Are we gonna be able to get it though? No. Dude, the box is halfway through the rock. All right, we gotta come all the way back again with more rockets. Guys, I'm 40 plus rockets, 16 plus C4 deep into this thing. Was that a TC? That is a TC. Can we get like a bag and place it back there? Guess we might as well throw a door up while we try to do this. I can't even imagine for such a perfect debunker. I bet that TC's loaded. I need to get a bag placed back there so we can spawn in, hopefully. Well, we have no option but to bring back even more rockets. Yo, this thing better be freaking loaded. Mostly expensive cliffside bunker, literally ever and probably possible. Guess I'll be right back yet again. Yo, if somebody would have told me this was going to take 50 plus rockets and over 20 C4, I would not <laughs> have believed them. Really hoping this TC is loaded. Going to be nearly impossible to profit, but we've already gone this far. We see the freaking TC right there. I guess we should probably place our own TC down. Okay, just going to block myself in for now. We'll destroy that TC when we want to leave. Please don't splash me and kill me. Oh my gosh, now we're exposed to the outside world, but we can almost get in it. No way, we have to take another half wall. Please let me place a bag. We can place a bag now, right? Oh, dude. At this point, we literally need to see like 100k sulfur just to break even probably, probably even more. We have to take this wall. Yo, if this thing is completely empty, we're going to be dry for rest of wipe. Oh my gosh, can we finally... Is it even... Is it just like unlootable? Yes, we're in! Oh, okay. Time to check this thing, guys, and I know it's not going to be profit. I don't even want to calculate how much stuff we used. I want to say we need to see probably 120k sulfur. Bro, this was truly an unlootable TC, and I guess there's no other boxes either. Here we go. Yes, let's go, dudes. It's in ore form, but we will take that. 31k GP, 162 explosives, 120,000 sulfur ore. Let's go, boys. Was it worth it? Heck no. I would never touch that thing again. I mean, imagine he had nothing in here. That's like every single piece of explosives that we have for the wipe. But anyways, we finally did it. And I'm confident saying that is the perfect cliffside bunker base. Let's see if there was any boxes on this top one and then I'm gonna be done here. It's a sleeper. Okay, maybe there's boxes? And yeah, are we even gonna be able to get up there? Yes, there's boxes too? Let's go guys, can we get crafted explosives? This is Milk Clan. Oh, this looks so juicy. I think that was to the outside world. I think it was a one wall raid. And we just screwed up big time. Sleeping with M2 on his back, though. And inventory full of AKs. Okay. We'll get these guys killed. I guess they locked all their boxes, of course. So, work on destroying these. I hope some counter doesn't come up right there and literally kill me from the back. Let's see if we can get this sealed. All right, these are all one hit away. And yes, I am expecting boom from this thing. Let's take them out one at a time. We'll start with this box. We'll see if we have room to place a box. I've got the rest of the stuff in the TC right next to me. Here we go. Oh, that was underwhelming. The thing is empty. Okay, comps box, 147 tech trash. We'll take that. 43 laptops, 34 CC. Can we find a spot for our box yet? Not yet. There's more AKs. We already have all the AKs we need sitting on his body. There we go, M2s. Looks like these guys were using their M2s up. 
Freaking all broken, basically. Seven supply signals. Let's see if we can get boom. More AKs. Yeah, we'll just have to try to get this stuff out of here quick. I don't think we're going to find a spot for boxes. More AKs. I hope that's not the boom box. <laughs> HVs and incendiary rockets. Partial boom box. There we go. A bunch of exploit ammo. We can recycle for gunpowder. And yeah, I guess these guys didn't have C4 and rockets, but... We scored on the TC at least, got the M2's comps. I know I'm repeating myself at this point, but that was an insane cliffside bunker base. Dude, honestly, perfect. Can't see anything being built better. Basically unlootable TC if you go in through the bottom. I'm guessing he was able to loot it through the rock and then once I destroyed it, yeah, the bag falls and you can't loot it anymore. Epic though. Great job, Milk Clan. Thank you for not being broke. <laughs> Hey guys, so after that perfectly built cliffside bunker that was extremely difficult to loot the TC, I wanted to search for a base that was kind of easier to raid. We've got something here. My guy actually has a sheet metal door on an armored doorway. Here, I'll show you guys. So this entire stone outer portion was completely useless. You guys can see the sheet metal door on the armored core here. It's a two by two in the core. Not sure if it was raided or something, but we're going to find out. Good sign that it's not decaying, I guess. But it's just kind of strange how he didn't finish the base build. He didn't put window bars or outside doors. But without further ado, let's try this sheet metal door. See if we can get lucky here. Okay, there's an armored door. That gives me hope that there's still some stuff in here. Even armored foundations too. We'll send four rockets. Looks like a possible shelf here. And I don't know where this would lead. There we go, boxes. Can we get to a TC? Probably behind that door. Yeah, we'll take this door down. And there is sulfur in the furnace, so I don't think this thing was raided. Of course, the boxes are locked. Get a door up in here. Our own TC down. And I guess we have some work to do trying to hatch these boxes down. Yeah, they're, <laughs> why do people got to do this to me? Okay, we've got eight boxes down to one hit away. We'll start checking loot here. We don't really need to see much to profit. I mean, we already got the 1700 sulfur. Probably need to see like 4K sulfur overall extra to be into the profit. Here we go. <laughs> no, is it all going to be empty? Bro. There we go. Okay. Those tools could have came in handy when I was destroying these boxes. Why are they all empty though, dude? Come on. Okay, 111 tech trash, guys. This dude's about to be rich. I think we're about to find some sulfur and boom. At least the targeted computers and CC cameras will come in handy for making some turrets. Looking for a boom box. We got gear sets. 47 exploit ammo, if that's his boombox, that's not good. And weapons, okay, well, comes down to TC. Please tell me this guy was a sulfur farmer. Yeah, okay, well, we'll take it. That basically doubles our stuff that we used, so can't complain. No massive jackpot from this thing, but we'll keep on looking after this. Maybe look for one more base to raid. All right, dudes, we've got an excellent base here that can be the finale of the video. This thing is completely armored, man. Check that out. Now, there were some gaps in the high walls, like a couple walls missing, and I found a bunch of auto turrets sitting on the foundation. I'll go run up and show you guys that, but pretty sure we're going to have to rocket them out. Okay, so we had this gap, but yeah, you guys can already see this. There's like three or four right there. Pretty sure there was another gap over here too. Yeah. And then there's this gap. This one had less turrets to take down. So that other side had like three or four. Pretty sure there was only, yeah, there's that turret. And we might actually be able to scoot in the base just by taking that one turret. Wondering if we can do like a really nice C4 toss onto it instead of having to shoot four rockets off. Oh, dude, that's a tough toss. We could try it. At least get it close to weaken the turret and then send like one or two rockets if we don't get a direct hit. Oh, I don't think that's going to happen, actually. Wait, I hit it directly? Let's go, dudes. Did not see that coming. 
turret on the right. We can scoot past that and we'll go for the door. Here we go. Let's make the run. Let's go. I didn't even get shot. And then, yeah, we'll go for the front door on this thing. Okay, looking for turrets inside the actual base here. I think we're clear. Looks like your typical clan base with shooting floors, peak downs. Guess we'll keep following the path. Looks like the core, a three by three. We'll take the door path since it is all completely armored. Feeling like this raid's going to be super profitable. Just based on how much HQM has been used on this thing. Oh, and garage doors are open. Okay, which clan was this? IHBP? Sleeping with a bunch of ammo. And we'll send rockets here. Take down all these garage doors at once. Where's that? Four bags in here? Actually a four-man clan? We'll check all these boxes in a second. Just want to get TC so we can be safe. That's the pathway up. TC should be in one of these, hopefully. There we go. Slap a door up on the front. And time to start checking boxes. I'm feeling really good about the prop on this raid. Yeah, 200 gunpowder, auto turret. Almost looks picked through. That's kind of concerning. Like maybe he moved his loot somewhere, but you can still have hope. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, boys. Extremely profitable. We can recycle all of that for so much GP. Can we get any rockets or C4? 7 C4, 12 rockets? That's already more than we use. 1500 sulfur. 78 tech trash. No way that 2x2 two two had more tech trash. Okay, spreading his tech trash around. Supply drop. Oh my god, let's go, dudes. 50 C4. 100 and what is that? 137 rockets? I told you guys this was gonna be profitable. Still have TC to check as well. Here we go. Can we get sulfur too? Yes, dudes, the 69,000 raw and cooked. Bro, we are set for the entire wipe now. That feels good. Also, the perfect raid to end the video on a jackpot, boys. Let's get loaded up on the best stuff, and I'll show you guys what the first trip is going to look like out of here. Definitely going to have to take multiple trips to get the rest of this stuff, though. Okay, here's what the first trip is looking like. Leaving with literally 75 C4. Still need to come back for the supply signal and the rest of these comps and stuff, but I'll spare you guys the time of me doing that. And yeah, just excellent overall day of raiding. Glad we got something from that bunker to start with. Anyway, Let's get subbed we'll be doing some more raids every day for the rest of the week i'll see you guys in another video tomorrow and wish me luck we should be finding a big clan base to use all this on and i do have some targets that i've actually already scouted so yeah see you guys soon hope you enjoyed